So today we gonna talk about this error, uh, the hash uh, value. So uh, when you try to file the ITR5 uh, and that is through offline version and your uh, Excel utility. So yeah, I select all the parameters. If you see here, the ITR5 and continue and try to attach the Excel utility, uh, which is download. Okay. So Yeah, so you will see here the invalid hash value identified the modification to ITR uh, is there. So this error is basically uh, not for the data that you have filled in, uh, you know, uh, for for your client. Uh, rather than this is more of uh, the technical uh, uh, problem of uh, the system you are having. So maybe your system would be old or uh, the multiple reason can be possible. So simply what you have to do is... Uh, you need to uh, go into this uh, site. Uh, I will give you the link and you uh, need to download this uh, NetFrame 3.5, uh, which will have this version uh, 2.0 and 3.0. So once you download this, uh, you know, uh, install this uh, framework uh, from the Microsoft, uh, you need to restart your system. Uh, so once you will install this net framework, we, what do you need to do? The next step is you need to go and search for features. So uh, maybe you can search simply the feature. Uh, no, sorry. So you need to search for Windows feature. So it will give you this option. Turn on Windows features on and off. So if you go here, so uh, you will have this net frame 4.8, which is already there, but now you will have this net frame work 3.5, which will have this both the version 3.0 and 2.0. So this should be, you know, tick mark all the three and make it on. So basically you have to, uh, you know, earlier you won't have this, or maybe you will have installed in this, your system. Maybe you can check from here as well. And if it is installed, you need to just turn it on. And after turning it on, you need to go back into your Excel utility and generate the JSON file again. And once you uh, again uh, generated your JSON file and saved into your particular place, just go again into the income tax portal and attach and try to attach the uh, try to attach the file, uh, the correct file uh, for it. So once you will, uh, you know, upload the correct file, it will show the verified successfully. So for in my case, why it is showing me the error? Because it is already being submitted this uh, income tax return. But if you see, there is no error into my uh, return other than this, that, uh, that your, you know, your return is having some other problem. So yeah, that is it guys. Uh, hope this can be useful. I will give all the information in the description that can be helpful to you and please, uh, subscribe to this channel uh, so this helps to you know I can create the more videos that can be useful to the people into the finance or uh, to the uh, business community yeah thanks a lot please